We are in the middle of an AI boom. And it's exciting. Every day something new pops up, new artificially intelligent tools that help efficiently and effectively complete a variety of different tasks. In this video, I'm going to show you a new AI tool. A tool that rewrites AI generated content, making it difficult to detect. Until now, it was extremely easy for AI to detect AI. But today, in this specific video, I will show you how to trick scanners, how to trick websites like CopyLeaks and GPT-0. For that, I will use a new cool product called Bypass GPT. Let's put this product to the test and see if it actually works. Let's see if we can trick AI scanners. Let's review Bypass GPT. Sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Without further ado, let's get rolling. Seriously, I don't know why AI scanners are so important why can't they just create a thesis and make AI generate an article for me? Why is it so important for people to know whether I created the post by myself and wrote every single word or just used the AI to generate text? I don't know. So I am pro websites. I am pro platforms like Bypass GPT. But let's see if it actually works. This is what I typically do if I need a craft an article for my website, my blog. I would create an outline first, I would create a thesis and I would make ChatGPT write a post for me. This is what I would typically do. I would request ChatGPT to write an article about a certain subject. Let's say we'll create something simple. Write an article about bypass GPT being a revolutionary tool. I'm pretty sure that most of you use ChatGPT for similar purposes. It's, it's convenient. I'm going to copy this article and then I'm going to go on the website called copyleaks.com. So if you're not familiar with this tool, it's a very popular tool and you can use it for free to just see if, if the scanner can detect AI generated content. So I'm going to paste my article here and click on scan. And this is what happens, the scanner detected AI generated content. Let's use another tool, another popular tool called GPT-0. Let me paste my article here and see if this particular tool will detect AI generated content. And once again, I see the same exact outcome, 100% probability. There is another popular AI detector called Zero GPT. Let me paste my article here and see if this scanner will detect artificially intelligent, artificially intelligently generated content. Yeah, 79%. According to the creators, Bypass GPT supports bypassing nearly all AI detectors. Yes, you heard it right. It's actually going to be my first time testing the tool and I'm excited. So I will take this article, I will copy this article once again, and now I'm going to paste the text on Bypass GPT AI. Now I'm going to ask Bypass GPT to rewrite this article that was originally created by ChatGPT and see if it's going to help me trick these scanners. There are several different modes, fast, creative, and enhanced. I will use the enhanced mode and I'll try to humanize the text. Beam, boom, 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 boom. All right, perfect. Let's see. Well, I can see the results here because this tool actually helps you verify everything automatically. But I will also manually copy and paste this regenerated text on the previously mentioned websites such as CopyLeaks, GPT-0 and uh, ZeroGPT.com. Let's begin with CopyLeaks. Let's see if this time around, oh, I didn't even finish my sentence. All right, according to the results, we see the CopyLeaks.com believes that this article was generated by a human. Perfect. Let's do the same thing with GPT-0. 
Let's run a test and see the results. Human. Let's now use the third tool and see if AI generated text can be detected. 0%, 0%. I personally think that Bypass GPT is a truly, truly great tool. It saves time and energy. And this is what I love about the AI era. We need more tools that make our lives more convenient. The good news is that you can start using Bypass GPT for free. And if you decide to upgrade your plan, you can do it later. And you can also try to use the code in the description for an additional discount. The discount code is in the description. I'm done for today. I hope you enjoyed this review. If so, leave a comment in the comment section. Let me know what else you want me to review in the upcoming episodes. I'll talk to you soon. Ivan KV out.